The heavy rains in Somalia have taken the lives of almost 100 people, according to state news agency SONA on Saturday. It said in a post on social media 96 people had perished, adding the figure was confirmed by the head of the country's disaster management agency. The constant downpours are putting fear into the country's residents, like Hawa Ali Ahmadin. These floods are double compared to the previous ones. You can't take a risk in this one. When it's raining, we sit outside under a tent until the rain slows down. We only come in the house when the rain slows down so that we can cook for the children. Somalia and the rest of the East Horn of Africa have been battered by relentless heavy rains that began in October, caused by El Nino and Indian Ocean Dipole weather phenomena. Both are climate patterns that impact ocean surface temperatures and cause above average rainfall. The flooding has been described as the worst in decades, displacing 700,000 people, according to the United Nations. The intense rains are exacerbating an already existing humanitarian crisis caused by years of insurgency. The head of Somalia's Red Cross, Pascal Kutat, says the worst is not over yet. We have currently a confluence still of the Indian Ocean Dipole of El Nino. We have a cyclone building up uh, in the Indian Ocean. We have rains continuing in the highlands of Ethiopia. All of that means that this is not over and it's not yet at its peak. It's getting worse and these people are, are going to suffer more. In neighbouring Kenya, the floods have so far killed 76 people, according to the Kenyan Red Cross, destroying roads and bridges, as well as leaving many residents without shelter, drinking and food supplies, according to the charity Doctors Without Borders.